Jesus Christ, you are the light of the world. The light no darkness can overcome. Stay with us now, for it is evening. And the day is almost over. Let your light scatter the darkness. Oh,
from the very beginning, darkness and light have been part of God's magnificent universe. When God creates the light, the darkness is not extinguished or cursed, but it is complemented. Light and darkness each have a purpose in the created order. Each is necessary for the unfolding of God's salvation history, day and night together, as two parts of a whole are declared good. Genesis 1 and 2. First, this, God created the heavens and the earth, and all we see, and all we don't see, Earth was a soup of nothingness, a bottomless emptiness in the inky blackness. God's spirit brooded like a bird above the watery abyss. And God spoke light, and the light appeared. God saw that light was good and separated light from dark. God named the light day and named the dark night. It was evening. It was morning. Day one. As we begin our Advent season, we enter a season in the year of early darkness. Very quickly it becomes dark at night. And we think about darkness. And we are invited to see this advent that darkness is good, that both the light and the dark complement each other in God's created universe. But we also are th invited to consider that the light, our Lord and Savior, this advent season and always breaks through the darkness of our own life, of our world. And it is in that hope, it is in that promise that the light will never be overcome by the darkness that we celebrate this Advent season, that we proclaim with Mary that our God is amazing, that our God has brought hope joy, peace, and love. I invite you to join me in prayer. God, we thank you for the light and the dark, the day and the night, and its place in the universe. We thank you most of all for the light of our Lord and Savior who breaks into the darkness of our lives, of our universe, and reminds us who you are, a God of hope, a God of peace, a God of joy, and a God of love. May we, this Advent season and always, live in your light, in your hope, in your joy, in your peace and love, and may we share it with all people. Amen. Just